Welcome, this is the energy vibration reading for the Taurus Sun, Moon, and Rising. Is <laughs> I want to say welcome, thank you for being here, thank you for being back. Um, your week is a bit strange, so I'm going to change up your readings because. Um, okay, this is the fourth week of August 2017. I want to say thank you for the support, the likes and share. Thank you for supporting my channel. Thumbs up to all you Tauruses out there. We're all Earth sign people. We're all here supporting each other. It's going to be a week where the energy vibration of the Virgos is about to come in because it's uh, going to be their birthday. So they're going to be helping us in the next 30 days. So from the beginning of the um, from Wednesday the 23rd you're going to see and feel the changes coming on and you can really see it in the spreading because the first two days of the week because this week is a week of the fire uh, element and the, and the 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 earth energy and what is happening in this week I can see it already because you're a Taurus your earth sign the first two days of this week is you know really whoa and as it begins from um, Wednesday your week is getting better okay so whatever the situation is from Wednesday your week is getting better so whatever that was going on around you and uh, you have one major arcana and that is the best um, energy you could ever ask for in a wheel and it's, it's, it's positive it's a positive energies okay what is happening for a lot of you you'd be working and having the energy for some of you you will be carrying the energy of the Prince of Cups the Prince of Cups is the energy vibration of someone who is a Pisces a Cancer or a Scorpion whatever the situation is um, you be carrying this energy vibration some of you will be working with this person who has the energy vibration of a Pisces a Cancer or a Scorpion okay this is a positive energy because you're dealing with some emotional situation and we can all see it in your reading from the first half of the week so let's look further to see what's happening for you guys because I was thinking about doing a triple reading because this is going to be but it's not that bad oh it's good whatever that was happening for you Taurus is going to be good whatever in the situation was okay let's look at your week um, um we have there is there is a lot of situation that is happening with um, healing of family whatever the situation is the healing of family there will be strive but you know you're going to stand up against this whatever is happening you have a situation that is going to happen with the Queen of Wands, whoever this person is, you have to have balance with this person, whoever this Queen of One person is. Um, then you have a situation with strength, which is the energy vibration of this week. Energy vibration of this week is strength. So it's a week and strength comes back on Saturday. So whatever is happening on Saturday, you are going to have a situation with your family on Saturday and you need inner strength. Okay, so find the inner strength. Remember that love is the only thing that is real for you, Tauruses. So it's let's go in deep because I was trying to the number nine energy is going to play a significant role in your life the number nine energy is going to play a significant role in your Taurus's life in this week number nine number nine energy vibration is going to play a significance in your life in this week number nine and number ten number nine and number ten and this is the first time number ten comes up um, twice okay let's go in your reading on Monday we have the energy vibration of an air energy okay the energy of uh, this 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 air energy is the nine of swords whatever is happening some of you will be worrying I've always said people we need not to worry if there's a situation happening in your life you need to pray about it ask the universal angels your guiding angels to come in and help with the situation whatever the situation is call them in and said this is my situation you have seen what is happening around me you have seen the dishonesty of people around me I'm asking for divine intervention stop 
um, worrying over things because when we worry it's a it's a diff, it's a sort of um, way that we are praying okay worrying is a form of prior so we need to change that energy vibration to something positive and think and ask the universal angels for divine intervention in whatever situation it is in your life so no worries we're going to leave the worries behind because the ego brings up this worries and showing you all different sort of scenario and you're thinking all these sort of a sort of scenarios when you let go of the worries you're going to be triumphant there is going to be an healing of whatsoever is happening the energy of the tree of cups is a celebration over this worry so whatever you had that you were worried about on Monday you need to release this energy to the universe and ask them to replace it with something much more positive and take it away and heal it and bring you something different we need to understand that if we don't ask and we constantly worrying about things we will never ever change who we are and the energy vibration because worry is a form of praying remember this if you release this energy of worry you are going to see that you're going to be victorious and you're going to celebrate whatever you were worrying about you're going to see that the universe has brought something positive into your life and this is going to be good for you so whoever you are out there whatever the situation is on a, um, Tuesday another sword energy another hair energy um, you have you're dealing with situation that has to do with Aries Librans and um, the Gemini's whatever that situation was that you were worrying about on Monday on Tuesday um, whatever that has happened you're going to realize that this worries and the whatever that people were doing lying backstabbing and that sort of a thing that is going to come to an end on Tuesday so whoever you are out there whatever has taken place on Monday there is going to be an healing on Tuesday because on Tuesday you have the energy vibration of the ten of swords in the reverse form and you have the seven of cups so you are you know it's as if whatever has happened now you you it's behind you it's as if you are letting it go and you are seeing new positive horizons um, coming up for you in the future and this is just so wonderful because I'm seeing a lot of people whenever you worry you're um, bringing that energy vibration so we release yourself of worries and uh, um, on Monday you release yourself of words because on Tuesday you have the energy vibration of the ten of swords the swords are falling out in your back whatever lies that has been told whatever that was done against you you're realizing you that you these are coming to an end new possibilities new opportunities new creative ideas will be coming up for a lot of people so it's going to affect this week is a week that is going to affect a lot of people it's a week of victory that is going to affect a lot of people so all you Tauruses that was going through certain things in your life changes are going to be coming in as we look at the week a lot of you Pisces are have to deal with someone who's an Aries and Leo or a Sagittarius whoever this person was it was someone that has done injustice and in balance this person was dishonest this person has done um, um, things to you Tauruses that was very dishonest and now he has been caught in his tracks and you are going to be victorious over him okay um, and I'm and, and getting um, I'm seeing I'm feeling um, that some of you had a business situation with this person some of you realized that this person was um, a dishonest person and um, that has brought you in so many things some of you this person had broken your house uh, whoever this person was he has done you injustice lies and that's why you begin the week with the worries and the lies and the ten of swords falling out of your back because it's cost door an Aries a Leo and a Sagittarius it depends on who you are and with who you're which fire sign you're working out the situation with but you will be victorious you're going to be victorious over this person this person is a dishonest person and he is now caught in his steps as we move forward congratulations Thursday seems to be 
the day in this week because I'm seeing a pattern coming up in this year is that each day in a week as a sort of a healing energy and because the energy vibration of the heart is changing this is all happening um, around you as we look on Thursday you have the wheel of fortune this is the best card you can have in the deck the wheel of fortune is uh, bringing you the ten of Pentacles congratulations congratulations so whoever you are out there people on Thursday the wheel of fortune it doesn't have to be Thursday it can be sometimes in the week you can um, receive and realize that the your financial situation the wheel of fortune is bringing you the ten of Pentacles so you Tauruses whatever you have been doing whatever you have been going through whatever you, you have been trying to access in your life whatever situation that has been happening for you you are going to realize that you Tauruses uh, on Thursday is as if by magic by the lottery for the people who are in the States the Powerball is doing well the last time the mega ball the power ball whatever state you are in buy the lottery people you can at least give out a dollar to or, or so to buy the lottery buy the lottery whenever the wheel of fortune and the ten of Pentacles comes up you can buy the lottery for Saturday because the drawing for Wednesday already gone and I'm sorry you guys just need to try try it out okay wheel of fortune ten of Pentacles this is money coming to you it's the wheel of fortune remember it's the wheel of fortune so buy the lottery this is a good sign for you Taurus so whatever it is buy the lottery I can't give you the number <laughs> So I know people are going to call me or text me and or, or write me write, write a mail and ask me for the numbers. No, I don't do that because whenever people like myself, we will never win the lottery because that is not what our gift were meant to be. Okay, so please do not email me to ask me what is the winning number because we're not supposed to do that. If someone gives you a winning number, they're breaking the rules. Of the law of attraction okay as we go on we're going on on Friday whatever the situation is on Friday you have a situation with these fire sign people you guys are working with the fire sign people in this week you have the energy vibration of the Queen of Wands. whoever this person is you are going to have a situation and you need to have balance with this person whoever she is you need to have balance with this person this is the energy vibration of an Aquarius uh, a Libra an Aquarius a, a, uh, no Aquarius a Sagittarius or a um, Leo person whoever this person is you need to have balance with this person it doesn't really matter who she is or what is happening you need to have balance with this person on Friday okay so again on Friday you're going to have a situation with someone it could be your mom if your mom is a Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius there is going to be a, a situation and you need to bring a balance okay um, this situation if you you need to bring balance to this situation with whatever that is happening with this person as we move forward on Saturday we have the energy vibration of inner strength this is another fire energy with whatever the inner strength is is has to deal with your family whatever the situation some people it's going to be with their family some people it's going to be with people who you have known in lifetimes in lifetime if you're working with groups in an organization in that situation these are uh, a sort of a family that comes back in this time so if you work in in a company um, where you you because you, you work with people these are people who are seen as cosmic family that you have to work out certain situations with so you have two family you have the family you were born with and the cosmic family and this is a situation that is happening um, and this is taken taking place at work for some people and for some people it's in their home life their family life their friendship that it needs you have to find inner strength to deal with the situation as we move forward we have the energy vibration of the five of ones is another fire energy so you have 
um, fire energy is coming at you whatever the situation is it's a conflict between you and someone who is an Aries a Libra or a Sagittarius uh, Aries a Libra what is it with the Sagittarius Aries a Libra or a Gemini whatever this conflict is is a woman that is either a Gemini a Libra or a Aquarian whatever the situation is uh, remember that love is the only thing that is real if we're going to decide to use our ego base with somebody like this be aware because if we're trying to stamp or a foot with someone who's of an air sign you need to understand that you are a hurt sign you are among a, a grounding person a balanced person this person is just not balanced this is someone who carries the energy vibration of the hair you never know what they are going to do but they're on predictable they're not predictable they're unpredictable so whenever you have conflicts with these pieces be aware of whatever will play around this so this is a week which beginning of the week you have the energy vibration of um, the, um, the 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 hair sign you have worries on Monday but that came out to be a wonderful celebration on Tuesday the ten of swords fall out of your back so the first half of the week is a situation where things that was dishonest and things that has done to you in dishonest form you're now seeing that the energy vibration of you um, working out certain things um, is as if people but you know you were being um, lied people were really uh, playing a dishonest game and now the, the the truth is coming out okay and that has to do with someone a man um, the energy vibration of a masculine energy because it can be a female but yet still that female has a more dominating masculine energies and they have the situation that some people were dealing with the, the Aries some people were dealing with the Leo some people were dealing with them as Sagittarius in this week so you need to understand but you're going to be victorious over them you Tauruses okay as we look at the second half of the week it's going to be a positive one because the wheel of fortune is here with a ten of Pentacles whenever the wheel of fortune with the ten of Pentacles that means it's a time where people are going to like win the lottery so it's Thursday so I would say by the lottery in the weekend it is good because you have a chance to win something the wheel of fortune is bringing a lot of money for a lot of Tauruses so if you had a situation with a fire sign that there was a legal suit you're going to win this um, legal suit and it is a karmatic situation that is coming around and you're going to be positive at the base of the the second half of the week on Friday there is a fire energy conflicts with the Queen of Swords which is the energy vibration there's conflicts you're going to have conflicts with someone who is an Aries a, a, a Libran or a um, Gemini be aware of the situation be aware of whatever is happening okay do not get in conflicts with these people because you're an earth sign person uh, on Friday you have also a situation the situation with love is 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 it's the healing on Monday and Tuesday okay whatever it is not a situation of love of the family love of it's an healing that is happening on Monday and Tuesday so whatever is happening this love situation with whoever it was more of a situation that people were lying people were not speaking the truth people were doing things that was unjust to you and now there is a healing on Monday and Tuesday I'm working with the chakra cards so let's see uh, for you Tauruses what is the energy for the chakras for you Tauruses and you have self worth so this is a positive energy to come up in this week for you Tauruses because self word is um, where we really look at ourselves and realize that what is going around is not what is going around us and what people are saying about us it's not who we are and most of the time the energy vibration of people can be so horrible and um, so untrustworthy and so um, 
dishonest that the energy of trustworthy comes up and it's the inspiration is people events and materialistic object beyond your fame or a reference or being drawn to you aim and ire for you will draw even greater experiences into your life allow your energies to grow receiving is an action so this is a wonderful week because we have the wheel of fortune with the ten of pentacles so this is a very good that's the inspiration for the week as we look at the personal inquiries what you should inquire yourself how do I relate to the world how do I relate to the world am I deserving am I ready to allow myself to receive what others may not so that this is these are good questions to ask yourself in this week as we move forward and we're looking at the key ideas of the week we have a greater knowledge innocent um, consciousness curiousness being aware and re uh, rewarded for good receiving divine help and this is good I've always tell people try and ask for divine help your keywords is going to be fate self-love and value so whatever the situation is you can see it playing out in the first two days of the week and it's going to be yield I am working with the angel answers so if you have any messages for the angel answers ask your um, um, question and let's see what is the answers the message uh, for you recovery oh my god this is really really a week of recovery especially in the first beginning of the week it is a week of recovery a lot of you have been going through certain situations in your life it is it is unjust situation unfair situation and you're finally having a recovery so whatever that has been happening you're recovering from this this is a period of recovery and healing for you the challenging emotions that you have been dealing with will fade away within time although it may be difficult to see now there is a joyful future awaiting you but for now take all the time you need to regain your strength and it is the energy of the weakest strength this calls for also meaning your recovery is nearly finished or already completed send words of gratitude to heaven and begin planning for the next exciting phase of your life so this is really a week of recovery for you people and I want to say to you thank you for being here thank you for being back please listen to the monthly reading the fourth week to um, see what other information is in the fourth week that will work with this week energy vibration reading and I'm saying namaste until next week